Developing tonight, an active manhunt for a carjacking suspect who disappeared into the Blue Hills Reservation earlier today. This all started in Randolph, and that's where we find NBC 10's Michael Rosenfield with the very latest. Michael. Corey, this all began with a carjacking that took place here in the parking lot of this apartment complex here in Randolph last night. And tonight, two of the suspects are in custody after a police chase. Police swarming in Milton near the Blue Hills Reservation after suspects driving a stolen car were spotted. The three men had carjacked a resident of the Francis Crossing apartment complex in Randolph late Tuesday night. I don't think about it because I have the dogs with me all the time, so I'm always thinking that I'm protected. And yeah, I probably will lock my doors now. The car was seen by police in Randolph on Wednesday, leading to a chase when the driver would not pull over. The pursuit was terminated as the suspect was driving in an unsafe manner, according to investigators. State police tried to stop the car in Milton, but the three people ditched the vehicle and ran off. White shirt, black sweatpants, just run through the woods, and um, there's two stadies directly behind them. Police chased the suspects. One was taken into custody right away. The other was located by a police canine. The third suspect managed to escape. But there's lots of good places to hide. There's acres and acres and acres of, of woods. This is a busy area with lots of traffic on Route 138 and countless people often traversing the reservation along the Milton-Canton line. I always take precautions, especially like alone with my dog, but... I do think it's a super safe area. The 40 year old man who was carjacked Tuesday night says one of the suspects had a gun, one had a knife. They robbed him before stealing his car around 10 30 p.m. I might just uh, make sure that my doors are locked tonight just to make sure that nobody can hurt my family. So, right now, one of the suspects is still on the run. Police have not released any description of whom they may be looking for. Ivan Randolph, Michael Rosenfield, NBC 10 Boston.